Hello everyone, welcome aboard. I'll be your Captain Hillian today, along with... Oh, from a mighty fuck here at your service. The mightiest of lieutenants. And welcome... Oh. <laughs> and welcome back for the 15th episode of Dave the Diver. I'm pretty sure it is the longest we've done <laughs> with the game so far. And uh, yet again, I have to say, I don't really have that much to complain about with being yeah. this long. I, I think I'll close it in on uh was the other one K Uh the Metrovania like. Hmm? Uh, uh Victim of Night uh, Bloodstain, thank you. Bloodstain. Okay, what is up with give me a second here? Maybe that'll do better. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Hello Tatum, and yes, they have. <laughs> Welcome I to the show. <laughs> and yeah, let's continue with the game. Where let's see, last time. Uh, yeah, last time I'm pretty sure we did. We had two big discoveries. Well, technically three. Uh, one, there's a. <laughs> okay, force right away. Tatum is just not like to be called a little potato. <laughs> Uh, we tried to say potato, but my, my head, when I read potato, yeah, my brain often wanted, already want to go potato for some reason. <laughs> okay, but yeah, we we discovered that uh, the environmentalist group, Sea Blue, is just a front for a bunch of poachers, or it seems to be. We also found that, uh, yeah, there's a giant freaking zombie underneath the Sea People village causing trouble. And, well, we also learned that Klaus is a motherfucking tank. Okay. Oh. Wait. I think I just realized you, you can make a pun from that. No. Uh, oh, I'm gonna butcher this accent. Uh, Klaus is a panzer. <laughs> uh, that's... What's that? Is it gone? Uh... I guess that we count more of language play or something. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I think I butchered it. I never tried a German accent. Was I even remotely close? <laughs> nope. <laughs> yeah, I butchered it badly. Sorry, Germans. It's... Sorry. The combination of tuna and rice is always fantastic. Can't can't disagree there. Wait, that light number. Hmm? 
98? No, no, the next one. 2023. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that one feels a bit specific. Let's see. Vincent is still eating it even after filming has stopped. He must have really liked it. Okay. Yeah, we also had this. This uh, chef off. With... Uh, I kind of forgotten his name. <laughs> okay. Now. We know it's going to be storming at least one more day. Yeah. Hmm. Now, now that I think about it, one more thing that would that could be added to the game at some point would be some sort of weather prediction thing or something. That way you would know if it's going to storm or such. Uh, but it'll probably end up cluttering a bunch. But yeah, we have today and tomorrow that we can go f uh, fish for sharks for the events. Let's see. I'm actually going to swap out to the sniper rifle here. For one, because it deals a lot of damage at a better uh, range. But also because, well, that fish man over there, we need to be at a uh, greater distance to get that. So, we're going to go look for sharks and for that jellyfish. And beyond that... Uh, don't think there's really too much we can do at the moment. Yeah, for I feel we definitely need to focus on the sharks so we have... But we can go really big plus on that event for... We, we can go mighty plus with a lot of money on that event that's coming up. We can relax more and do more of the story and all that. Yeah. And I forgot to look for upgrades to our equipment. Of which we can also now start upgrading the knife, finally. But uh, yeah. yeah, how are you doing, Tatum? I hope you're yeah, doing well you for us. Doing? Tatum, Tatum. <laughs> My brain seriously want to say potato. <laughs> okay. Oops, I'll take that. Now then. Let's swap over to that one so I don't accidentally put the bombs down. Uh, let's see, I'm procrastinating grocery shopping, okay. I just don't know what to get, or where to get it or something. Oh, oh hello. Hmm. Hey, Emir Romano, what does, does procrastinating mean? Uh, putting off, and it does look like the shots pierce, as you can see there. They since I got that guy as well. Okay, um, I think I'll just skin this one and save the drones for a bigger shark. Okay. Okay, let's see here. Can you oh, potato? I hope I said that right. I don't want to go to the store because of my Denmark trip. I've been in pain. Okay, what happened then? A lot of work as well. Uh, wait. Oh. But hey, Tom, did you. Do your bird shells also hurt your feet? Uh, let's see. We were on Legoland, lots of walking pain. You're, you're not supposed to step on the Legos intentionally, Tatum. Oh, that's the. Wait, did, it, did you also visit in Legoland in London? Uh, no, we were thinking about it, but we didn't actually go there. We did visit a few. We did visit a few Lego stores, though, and I was tempted to buy a set at one, but I decided against it. Uh, here, <laughs> then I don't notice a similarity. Alien also recently, actually this morning, got home when he was supposed to do it yesterday. Yep. And he Stupid. also have a pain in his feet. Yeah, I've had that for the last few days. It... Due to just bad, uh, <clears throat> due to bad uh, socks. Okay, That's... that is not not killed. Usually bad shoes. Yeah, for some re uh, for some reason this uh, for some reason the uh, socks were rubbing against my feet, even though they should be a our good fit. There we go. Going to send you up. Uh, 
Yeah, kids. Tatum, I have chronic back pain and bad knees and hips, so walking hurts. Yeah, I know. Oh. I, was just, I was just teasing you for a bit. But yes. Hopefully that'll subside soon enough. Yeah, I hope it gets better, or at least... Oh. Okay, I know it's way too late about chronic to know if it gets better or not, so maybe I should not say that. Yeah, chronic tends to be, uh, well, staying. Oh. It's... As of returning, it's... Uh, t -t 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 at least they let me borrow wheelchairs in Legoland, so, okay. That's that good, of good. course. Hell this was almost hidden in the crawl. All right then. I only want to give her a dreadnought, but I'm not sure if I trust her with one. <laughs> oh wait, no, you. Uh, them. As you realize, more. you only put a near dead person into a dreadnought. Yeah. For the gay thing. And yeah, so... Tatum prefer. Uh, was it that you preferred they them, or I think there was something about you. Sw uh, switching with that a bit recently. <laughs> yeah, they them. Oh, yeah. they them. All right. I've been trying to use the name because I keep forgetting which was I just go right. I just never see the name. That way, I'm not gonna go forget or mess up. Wait, did I mess up? Did I say one or the other thing accidentally? Uh, yeah. Oops, sorry. Okay. Hmm. Uh, all right, but yeah, I will, I will try to remember. At least you. Yeah. Hmm. All right. Oh yeah, I understand that. Yeah, I will try to remember that. Wait. What? Oh. 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 Now, this beeping is when we get close to the fishmon. So it's somewhere over there, and I have one shot left with the sniper rifle. Oh, that was a pain that I. Fish. Uh, okay, that's nice. I forget if we need to use the tranquilizer version of it or not. He wanted the previous one sedated. So I guess we'll see well when we catch sight of it. <laughs> yep. <laughs> completely <laughs> I completely overlooked the freaking puffer fish. Okay, where is our teleporting jellyfish? Oh, yeah, that. A striped bruise. Oh, okay. <laughs> we got it before they even got. Okay, yeah, please catch. Okay, and it just teleported away. Okay, so we. Uh, thanks for that. You just. <laughs> you cost me the catch. There. He meant catch, not cat. Okay. I probably should send this one up entirely, but. Oh. Okay. Yeah, it's still oh. close here somewhere. I guess that hurt. The uh, teleportation is a short one. Okay, yeah, it looks like it looks like you just <clears throat> knocked him out if you uh, do enough damage. Okay, that's nice that you don't you can't accidentally kill them. Okay, that actually good, yeah. <laughs> a freaking cuttlefish. Okay, let's go hunt some shark then. And yeah, we should be good for this uh, this diving trip. Hmm. Have I caught you before? A coral, a coral trout. We are, I believe, we are low on those. Oh, and of course, we have these big guys for which we still need our fins. So we're just going to bully them for a moment. Just short. Not going to be in this case. Okay. Do we get a fin? We need two more giant Trevale fins. No, we don't. Okay. Uh, let's swap these over. 
Also, I should probably I should probably use the fr <laughs> the freaking nets that I got. Okay, kind of forgot that I brought them along. Okay. Uh, we do know that they don't work on the big sharks, though. Hmm. So what do you use them then for? I just remembered something. It do you need to be, be, be name a chicken in this day game after Tatum? Uh, don't think we did, but we could name a chicken after them if they'd like to. Well, if they want to, sure. Okay, Ooh, purple. Those are not too common. Uh, yeah, we <laughs> we can. <clears throat> Well, we can't breed chickens, but we can get a bunch... Did I just forget to swap out the thing again? Uh, yes, I did. Okay, that is annoying. Uh, then I guess we'll just deal with... Yeah, we'll just deal with everything above this area. Yeah, I really should try to keep that in mind. Okay, some vinegar. Well, you uh, just got home and... Martin, do you get any sleep? Nope. So, yeah, I've been awake for more than 24 hours at this point, and, well, I'm at the point where... You, yeah, I can't... F I just can't fall asleep, really. Until, uh, yeah, I just hit the evening again. So, not sure if there will be a second stream today. But we will see. Yeah, we will see. Like, no promises. It could be... If we can, we will. If we can't, now you know why. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> as Drakir said, uh, <laughs> it'll be rather fitting for us to start with the next game, or the game there, if we uh, do, uh, in the evening, because, well, owls and uh, nocturnal <laughs> creatures, or being nocturnal creatures, <laughs> Okay, Iron Ore. We were low on that. They are more white than the... Well, they are a lot shinier than the lead nodes. Okay. Got three shots. Should be enough to get rid of another. Okay, it's just a dead end. Uh, yeah, we should be able to catch another two sharks or something. And yeah, we'll just fill up our pack with whatever space we have left then. Or for whatever space we have left. Yeah. Would this be another upgrade kit or is it just a better harpoon tip? Okay, no. It's a harsh start. Okay. <laughs> okay, okay, I did, I did not imagine. Why is the electricity in your knife? It's not the knife, it's the shark oh. stick. Shark? Wait, I did not realize you put a shark stick. I'm uh, so concerned. Okay, I was wondering why, why for a moment I didn't have control. Yep. Ooh. 71 damage, you. There we go. And... Still alive. There we go. Okay, let's send this one up. Actually, let's carve you. And with some luck, we'll get a big... Uh, we'll get uh, another hammerhead or something. Uh, let's see. Sword by remember weight. Remember about weight. Yeah. Let's discard that. I'll probably discard more Trevale if we don't get a fin here. Okay. I don't wonder you only get fins if you get the wool thing. Hmm. I think I got it from skinning them at one point, but I might have to look up if that might be a thing. 
Yeah, or it's a rare thing, perhaps. For you need it for an upgrade, correct? Yeah, for upgrading any of our weapons to level three. All right, then or I guess more it's, rank it's a, three. I guess it's a rare rank for. Uh, to, or, uh, yeah, now I think about it. I haven't seen you hunt the Murray Eels too much. Me? Just got the edge of that. But yeah, I'd prefer we take an upgraded sniper rifle into the fight with Klaus if we can get to that. So, yeah, we, re we really need to be at a constant distance to that thing. It's just too big to easily avoid. It's... Yeah, and I feel like we may, we may want to beat Klaus before the event. Any sharks I around not, this? I would, I would not be surprised if Klaus uh, dish. Uh, actually, can you sell those on it? Hmm. Yeah, there's probably a dish with whatever remains of him after. Yeah, for if it, I guess thing, if we can sell Klaus sushi or whatever dish we make out of him. On the event. Yeah, that would definitely be a big boon. Yeah, that's what I'm hoping for. Hence, more reason for us to do it. Hmm. We could try a run with the sniper rifle on him. The problem is going to be that. Oop. That's the Mako, I believe. I'm going to Mako you into a sandwich. Oop, missed. Yeah, it was the same damn bastard that got us killed last time. I... And you can see why. I just use this. Actually, yeah, I should bring a scooter down. No. Or the dodging Actually, as yes. well. A scooter may help. Dave the Sniper caught 10 fish with a sniper rifle. I'm not sure that counts as <laughs> catch. Dave the Sniper. Okay. Drink. Let's see, I didn't see how much that brought up, but I hope a decent amount. Now let's just grab these while we're here. We don't see these too often, I think. I keep forgetting about that one. Okay. Pretty low weight for a pretty big fish, only like 1.8 kilo on each of those. Okay. And now to head up. Uh, actually, yeah, I'll have wasted these two, but oh well. Yes, return to the boat. Um, we should check the farm. I didn't check the farm. Okay. Uh, keeping you and you the rest of you, well, good luck at the restaurant. Okay. Let's see. Hmm. The think a jellyfish that looks like it we're, well, like it's wearing a wizard hat actually exists. Surprise! We'll send you your fee when the issue is out on Monday morning. Okay. Yeah, the crops are all grown. And this thing is wanting attention again. Okay, it drew up. Okay, clean up. And I'm just feed it. it's still alive. <laughs> oh, okay. Wait. Hit him? Yes. Are you one of those ref you who did not somehow succeed to keep. just. to kill the Tamaguchi within the hour? I'm pretty sure they don't die that quickly. Uh, oh, 
Hy hydrothermal vents? Okay. Yeah, I remember my entire school struggled. They, they loved them, but a lot of hate people struggle to keep them alive. <laughs> I don't think I've ever actually had a Tamagotchi myself. <laughs> yeah, like, we got some, but we didn't wish for them or ask for them. But I think mother or someone else, our grandparents got them to us for the food, we would love them. But like, sure, they were interesting, but... Eh. <laughs> and yeah, feed, you know, feed the kitty. <laughs> okay, I have no idea if that's going to lead to anything new, but I really don't actually care too much about that either. Okay, we got some eggs. I'm curious, I'm curious about that as well. Now, we can harvest these. And again, there's no way you can convince me that that's not supposed to be a reference to uh, <clears throat> to Super Mario Bros. Uh, 2. Let's see. Cherry tomato. Okay. Uh, I'll leave... Okay, these will be done later today, I'm guessing, at the evening. Okay. Now, let's see. Uh, you want a chicken named after you, Tatum? <laughs> uh, let's see, while well, we wait for their answer, let me see. That is maxed out, that is maxed out. Um, let's see. 1280. 12k, 12.8k. Hmm. Let's go with the air tank, since we are planning to, well, go into a boss fight. Yeah. Like, the other one... Sure, we could be able to bring more shark meat and all that. Yeah, but we want to fight the shark boss anyways, so it's probably better there for... The other one we can get after the event, basically. Yeah. Okay. Uh, oop, oop. Yes, I'm still Watch your fish. I still pissed off over what happened last time. Like, you were so close to the top. Yeah. Okay, leave two breeding pairs. Put everything else away. There. Okay. Hmm. There and there. Yeah, we, we really get just a frick ton of these things, huh? There. Then again, these are the most shallow. Let's see. Hello, Glacier Boy! Hey, Glacier, you doing well today? There and there. Okay, we need, we need a breeding pair of these still. Uh, we need better of these. A hey, four, four, twenty-four. Okay, three of you. Nope, three of you. And then the rest of those. Okay, barrel jellyfish. All of the pack. Needs tuna. Okay, from Glacier Boy. Hello. Doing well, thank you. How was your holiday? It went pretty well, I'd say. The uh, end was uh, not too enjoyable. Since, well, flight got cancelled and I had to stay overnight with the family and not in a rest, not in a hotel or anything, just in the goddamn, uh, you know, <laughs> in the goddamn airport. So, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm currently at that point where I am tired, but I just can't fall asleep. So that will probably happen uh, <coughs> later tonight, but I am... Uh, I will say lucid enough to stream at least, and well, might as well, might as well stream something uh, chill like Dave the Diver. Then nothing too yeah, high I... uh, octane or anything. Yeah, and I miss. I think I don't know if you misspoke or if I misheard you for a moment there. Okay, what was it this time? I thought you said uh, I'm at least awake enough to scream. <laughs> no. <laughs> I think mean, you can see what, what kind of facial expression did when I heard that. Okay. 
You know, once you get this fish farm going, you really don't actually need to go after too many of these, huh? Yeah, maybe just a few. You have to, like, to fill up. But once you've got breeding pairs going, you're basically, you're pretty much set. Yeah, for, this is needed for if you want to be able to do the story. For it would be hard to do the story without this. Yeah, I think it'd still be doable, but it, it is a big help. Yeah, I, I did say, it would, hmm. it'd be hard to do the story, not impossible, just hard. We, we could try a night dive today. Not to look for Klaus, but to uh, go catch some sharks. Some, no, some more sharks. It's even more it would be worth sharks. it. It would be uh, worth it, especially since we... Again, that first short night. Oh, it's not dead. short night, just first day of that, that short, uh, storm short party. Okay. I'll take the under rifle, uh, underwater rifle too. Uh, oh, hold on. Make a phone call to Duff, what? Uh, actually first, anything we can upgrade? Yeah, we need one more Trevale and we need 30 more fragments for that. For the sniper rifle, we need also a giant Trevale fin, uh, fin uh, and opal ore. Okay. The opal ore we found a few times. We know we can get that at least. Yeah. Uh, also, where do we upgrade our... Up there. Just right down. Okay, from 3 damage to 10. Okay. That's a jump. I'll actually take that. We should be able to make more than plan uh, more than enough money to cover the uh, <laughs> the working costs. Seventeen. Okay. And anything new over it here? Each time. Okay. Remove jellyfish comb. Is just combs and bank tooth. Okay. Only one more. Hmm. Okay, what we could do... Actually, no, this, this won't work since it's not night. So we're going to try for more sharks now. And... Yeah, I think I'll go from the from the bottom up. We'll just... Uh, we'll, we'll drone the first big, two big ones that we'll find. Probably uh, Mega Mouse. Okay, oh, yeah forgot about that okay hmm <clears throat> and I forgot to make the phone call to Duff <laughs> of course <laughs> at least let's have a look here okay. hmm. what do we need Duff for then to get the workshop here open Okay. Five seaweeds. Okay. Uh, let's see. Sea grape. Agar. Okay, that takes time to expand out. Okay. Uh, let's get three of them so we can plant all, all five of the seeds that we have access to. And since we buy, I feel like I'm watching a pun. Yeah. Uh, aren't mantis usually known as sea cows? I think they are. Yeah. Yeah, That's... and don't usually use a cow or an ox to pull carts or plow the field. Uh, let's see. Do we have anything that might stand a chance over here? Yeah, ninety-eight. Uh, no. Let's see, anything here? Let's see, 56, 59 is the strongest. Going by the, well, the map, the speed that is, which isn't the best signifier. Uh, let's, actually, yeah, let's put, let's put our crown jewel in here. Okay.
smash that button. Slide. Oh, too much. Yep, too early. Oh, still ahead. Yep, too late. The hitboxes are the on these are a little bit big. There we go. <laughs> Despite messing up twice, still one in 23 seconds flat. Okay. Okay, that's 150 we got back. Okay. Uh, team race. Let's take a look. Uh, yeah, we couldn't beat these. Let's see. Uh, 56, 100, 153. Okay. If we can get a team with about four, about 200 total speeds. Let's see. Mm. Yeah, I think this will do. And if not, then well, we'll find out. Okay. Yeah, this really is just a lot like uh, the shower races. Since you could, I'm pretty sure you could cheer on your chows during a race, but for a lot of it, it was just uh, a bunch of statistics and a lot of random chance as well. Got someone hot on our tail. drop off too far. Wait, let's just yeah. name that? No, those were both yeah, those were both good passes. Let's see if I can get a perfect one. I only remember yeah. you, you doing them bad. <laughs> oh. Okay, neck and neck. Snout and snout. Okay, I can't tell which of these it will win this or not. And okay, by a literal nose. <laughs> okay. Holy. There we go. <laughs> been a while since I've <laughs> been a while since I've had something to clip, I'd say, or at least that I thought to clip. Okay. I forgot. I thought about a clipping was a thing. Hmm. It's been such a long time. <laughs> uh, let's see. Let's go with you first. Then. Hmm. Actually, let's put you last. So, let's see, max speeds. Yeah. Okay. It's only 70, but still, I want to get these uh, notched off. Okay, maybe I can get a better grasp of the hitboxes or something. Zoom. Holy. Okay, now it comes the tricky parts. There. Don't ask me how a seahorse slides, but oh well. But yeah, I think putting a good acceleration seahorse up front and your top, oh, ow, top speed one at the back will uh, yeah, give you a good head start. Though if you have a if, if you have one with slow acceleration and this sort of thing happens, then well, of course it's going to 
slows things down a lot. Hill, you on a hill? Yeah. You left it in the dust. <laughs> okay. I, I think the only thing was the thing you are taunting them by being clumsy. Maybe. They're not intentionally. Okay. There we go. Yeah, that, that probably counts as a bit of bullying. Okay. Enough of that, then. Let's head out. Get ourselves an upgrade at Mimas. Yes. Beluga whale to travel around in. Okay. Can we? Oh, we can actually speed up in the beluga as well. <laughs> okay, that makes the that makes the small price that to pay even more worth it. Okay. Holy. Okay, let's see. Harpoon damage and movement speeds. can't fight Klaus since it isn't night time and we can't get an upgrade for when we uh, when we can go fight Klaus so yeah for now again just yeah, fish more sharks or hunt more sharks and then we'll we'll give it a try at uh, this night and, oh, hello fight Klaus uh, we know where he should generally be. Yeah. And Wait, does he only see... spawn at night? Yeah, the vortex will only spawn at night. Oh, all right. Hmm. But we'll have to see if the sniper rifle is enough to beat him. Even yeah, though it and... deals only a small, uh, it only has three shots and, shot and such. But it would be a lot safer to uh, <clears throat> to attack with that than the other rifles. Yeah, I think it will be proven to do a little more damage with a trigon. Probably if it's not good enough to do the dodge to make that work. Yeah. I mean, like that, you really need to be a player who knows when to dodge uh, you start going effectively against Klaus. Yeah, a, a scooter should probably help with that, uh, but I don't think Cobra has one. Oh, these would be nice. Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, well, we can you... pass mm. scooter and bombs. Mm. I have a shot. No. We need this. Okay. Oop. Okay, that still counts towards getting rid of them. So no complaints from me on that. Okay, skull. A skull from... I think yeah, I learned something about uh, today, actually. Uh, just today, actually. Oh? Already in the seventies, before... For a short while, Game Workshop had their own record label. There were two bands before that who made songs referencing Warhammer. Okay. And the very first Warhammer song is called... Warhammer. Blood for the Blood God. <laughs> of course. And it was Bolt Thrower. Yes, that was the name, Ball Thrower, named after an artillery piece, Warhammer. Okay, I believe that one is worth quite a bit. The spider here isn't worth a lot, but the opal right next to it is. So... Give me that. 
Okay, oxygen tank, no need for. We already have one. Hmm. Uh, I, I mean, I'll just be try and see if I can find someone some food. Apparently, all the bands that I think are known is like. Have you heard of the band Sabbath? 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 No, I know of Sabaton. Not uh, Sabbath. I think I heard of the band called Black Sabbath, or there's something else. You know that uh, name? Yeah, Black Sabbath is a, a pretty known. Uh, I forget which genre especially, but they are pretty known. Yeah, well, I, I think I heard of Sabbath before as well. I'm just unsure. But they also made Warmer songs. That just loops back, I believe. Okay. And many of these songs, before the collaborator got permission from Game Workshop, they used their Game Workshop art for their music covers. Okay. It's kind of a thing since, let's be honest, many, especially of the old art, looked like they belonged on a metal album. Uh, let's see, Glacier Boy, Black Sabbath are metal bands. Proto Doom Metal, okay. All right. Like, I, I'm not too much into metal. Like the most metal uh, music I typically uh, would listen to would be like a uh, Hammerfall nice. and Sabaton. I, I like metal, but I come to many different flavors and like I do like listen to Sabaton, Hammerfall, and I might listen to something like Battle Lord or Van Canto. The, the one goes more like. Oh, I forgot what it is uh, called. You can call it a folk metal, but it also is very specific woods meant for the singing. They're modernized in a metal form, uh, but many of them use the vocals for different sounds. Okay, metal folk or something? Uh, folk metal, I know, like, there's hate volk. Yeah. Uh, oh, I'm thinking of a specific term for it. It's an old school, old method. I, I can do an imitation, like, run, dun, run, dun. Like, I have everything can make a different tone in the background along with the music. Chanting? Uh, uh, some kind of chanting. But it has a unique name. I just forgot what the heck it was. Like throat singing. Oh, uh, what was it? Throat singing. Uh, throat singing is not for that one. I would remember. That was an easy name. The other one is a name I trouble mm -hmm. remembering. For it's a unique, annoyingly. Mm -hmm. It's a one that you don't. It's a very unique word, basically. Okay. Was it Ratatan or something? Can't say I'll be of much help then. Okay, yeah. let's play this out. I might have to look up if I know Van Canto. Those, if you listen to Van Canto, you will probably see what I mean. Okay. Oh, well, wait, no, not see. You, you will hear what I mean. I doubt, I doubt it'd be a cappella or something. That's the room! I think that might be the word. A cappella? Yeah, I think that might be like heavy metal, full metal a cappella. <laughs> okay. I think that might be the word. Now, let's see, sort by weights, dump out the spider cramp, and get out. Or at least go look for another shark. Is it what? Like, I don't think I listen to much death metal or gro like. Battle Lord has some growl, but it's not overwhelming growl. Just right amount, if that makes sense. Mm, cookie cutter depends on the person. Mm. Uh, I listen to some old rock and metal, like Dream Evil. He said, "Listen to them." Come here, you. Yep. Not even a struggle. <laughs> impressive, but yeah, I'm impressive. Like, if I, I, if it sounds good, I like to listen to it. That's how I work. So I'm not like a metal owner, rock owner. Like, if it sounds good, I will listen to it. Simple as that. Yeah, it, music is a lot about personal taste and such. 
Yeah, and mm -hmm. sometimes yeah. yeah. So sometimes something that uh, sometimes people will just like one particular band and only them, or but oh, other times like you could only like one song of a band and just hate the rest or just not care for any of the rest. Yeah. Uh. But yeah, I do think it's good, uh, it's gonna help you to have a little more wide music man variety. And I listened to a lot of music when I was drawing in dorm school. Like, did I want, if, if, if I was drawing something that was like Celtic inspired, then I listened to bagpipes or some other Celtic folk music. But it helped. You have no interest in you. From Glacier Boy, I need to get going. Hope to see you later. Yep. Be safe, Glacier Boy, and hope to see you later as well. Yeah. See you next time, be that, well, later today or next week, next month, whatever. Be well. <laughs> yeah, be well. <laughs> That's what way to face things, ill. Okay, uh, let's pre cook I, I... this thing. I hope we will be able to stream tonight, but also I do hope after the stream that you will be able to just go to bed and fall asleep without an issue. Yeah. Okay. Any fins? I might have. I might have to actually catch one alive to get a fin off of it. It's gonna be this weird if you kind of feel like, you're, like if you're skinning it, it should be easy just to remove the fin like that. I, I don't think if. Like, had it been the heart or something on an organ, then sure, since you're harpooning it, you might damage them, but. You're, you're less likely to hit the fin with a harpoon. Mm -hmm. throw out a few more of these okay yeah it's it probably took me way too long to figure it out but I'm from to me it looks like if something is of a higher rank it is worth more in general and beyond that you have stars or levels in that oh hello Bruce you're going to be the last catch of the day I'm guessing They are not going to be weighed down. Okay, counter attack. There we go. I wonder if that will do more damage if we upgrade our knife further. For now. There we go. Oh, and that's the maximum amount that we can carry around. So, up we go. Let's see, a depth of 60 meters, more than plenty to get out. Okay. Mm. Oh, freaking I thrasher. Saying, please no make it short, please no make it short, I was thinking, and we got something else. Okay, I'll just dump out all the combs and the barracuda. But did they actually land a hit on each other there? I don't think so. But I heard a bite. A, a, a motherfucker. But it has a whip, there's a way? Actually, where there's a harpoon, there might be... <laughs> out of reach. <laughs> oh well. Hell, don't get greedy now. Okay, if we're going to go after Klaus, then... I think it'd be prudent to not do anything, to not grab anything else, or maybe one thing, because we can bring one, one thing back. Oh no. Okay. I hate my brain. Hmm? 
I just imagine a wind a, a Christmas update and they put a Santa hat on Klaus. Okay, good amount of all of that. Then you can and kiss the, the there. Okay. There. Okay, let's check the farm. Hmm. And you were saying something about uh, understanding something? Uh, I said, uh, I mean, you can guess the uh, pun from uh, put a Santa hat on Klaus. Yeah, Santa Klaus or Santa Claus. Yeah, oh god, I hope, I hope they don't, but I'll be not be surprised if they do. go <clears throat> okay we don't have enough money for more chickens and this is still holding one as new I think what did we name the first chicken uh, we named these Rom Hex and Liz I believe We're right Liz Okay, so do we... Shall we go on a night dive to go after even more sharks? I would say let's go for Klaus if we can. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Swap out this for the sniper rifle. We will have to be careful with the... Uh, Let's see. Dash speed by 30. Hmm. I think that might be more useful than just a small dash now. We'll have to be very lucky or very... Uh, we'll need luck with the ammo since I very much doubt that Klaus only has 120-ish health. Yes. Shop is closed, so we can't bring any extras from that. Uh, why is there a notification here? Where's that? Okay, I'm not seeing it. Eco watchers. Oop. There we go. And finally a level in this again. Eco gemstone bracelet. Okay, and the next one is going to be an eco waterproof bag. Okay, what would that do? Allow us to bring more stuff up? I hope so. Let's see. Increases the amount of mineral acquired by mining. Okay, that would be pretty good. When you're specifically going out to mine. Hmm. Okay. I'm going to... F not save scum or anything, but I'm going to put down a save on this. Let's see, we've used the bottom one. So we go back to the top. Right there. Okay. Just in case we uh, die badly. Okay. Let's go look for Klaus. I'm not holding up high hopes for this, but better to try and fail than to not try. Poor Beagle Shark? What the heck is a poor Beagle? I don't think that's going to help. I think they just make me angry with that if you whack his nose with that. Hmm. Actually, disassembling doesn't help. Oh. Oh, yeah, the black tip. You are a more aggressive version, I believe. Of the white tip. Not too much smarter, though. So, off you go. 
At the very least, our, what we get with the drone will be preserved no matter what. So we can at the absolute least catch two sharks. Not useful. Okay. Murray eel up there. Actually, let's grab that, since it does... the paralysis slow, would slow him down. Providing and... works on him, which I hope it does. Okay. I believe we need to drone you, or... Nope. Okay. Just to make sure that we might get a, <laughs> a breeding pair of those if we don't have them already. Row! I thought you said drone. Drown. I was wondering, wait, how the heck are you to drown a murray eel underwater? Okay. I was about to say no sign of the vortex, but there it is. Ow. How did. Okay, just whack it to slow it. Yep. Yeah, getting way too close. Ew. Yeah, go, I'm going to need to uh, find oxygen for it. There. Okay, yeah, you should be yep. worth a good amount if you're that annoying to kill. Yep. Not yep. annoying, but more time. Maybe this, this one will. Uh, post uh, air tank uh, earlier. Uh, let's see. Agar. Oh. Hmm. I think there's some some great strange. We have some strange creature. Let's so check with the camera. Okay. Wait. What is that? Oh, what are those? Target looking ahead. Red-lipped batfish. <laughs> okay. Come on, this way. Okay, it looks like it has legs. Ew. Okay, but I think those are actually feelers of a sort. It's a fish that has red lips. That's really unique. I'm just going to like this. Let's go up and show it to him. Okay. First off, though. Yep, that's a no on that. Um, where was that oxygen? Out Down. there. Oh. oh, okay. I thought those only filled like half. I, um, I guess there must. Have, yeah, I must. I was presuming that since the uh, oxygen canisters that you get fill a half. Okay. Uh, I just glad that thing was there for you. Were almost had an embarrassment there. Get you wrecked before the boss fight. Okay, let's not go in just yet and see if there is something to find up here. Oh, there was an air tank here as well. Mm -hmm. No, I'm more looking for an, a, a harpoon tip. Uh, well, I if it does like, come down to that. I mean, we were looking for an air tank, and there was one that was closer than the other yeah. one. Okay. I'm going to grab this to top off. Yep. Of course, just as it almost reaches, it gives up. Okay. Yeah, I'll have to trade some health to dodge him with by dashing uh, to avoid taking a lot more damage when he would actually hit land a blow. So yeah. Guten Tag again. Okay. And yeah, we don't know her phone number, so uh, we're kind of screwed. Yeah, great white shark, 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 Klaus. Okay. 
main its main attacks are to charge do the whirlwinds or it flail it round up that okay there's more ammo there okay and after this he's going to charge yep okay not get stuck on things yeah, dashing is a lot more <laughs> effective than, than taking a hit from him, where it's a lot less costly. Oh, going for that again. And that's my ammo gone again. Okay. Is more going to drop somewhere? Oh, hello. Now he's angry. Better to cost a little bit of oxygen to dodge than it does to take a hit from him. Oh, there's ammo. Thank you, Klaus. Danke schön. Oh, and of course I miss. So, oh, okay, that's new. Okay. Okay, give me that, give me that. Wait. Okay, still got it. Okay. If you dig your nose through the junk, please. Okay. Uh, going to play this game again. Okay. Very much that there's going to be a sniper rifle in there, yep. So if we can't get ammo, that might be the best thing, since he tries to get so close, and if we're dashing around, it's going to be harder for him to hit, or hit Dave. Oh, here we go again with this, though. Yeah, I don't think I want to be close enough to actually try and get a hit with our melee on him. Okay, he's going to dash. Dash, charge, whatever is coming, or there he is. <laughs> okay. Holy. Nope. Uh, nope uh. <laughs> okay, I thought we were going into phase three. What? 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 <laughs> oh. <laughs> where did the hell? Where the hell did you come from? <laughs> totally not Laura Croft aged up. Finally got you, Klaus. I'm sorry, young one. I couldn't get familiar with this area after all. A great white shark making a a great white shark making a whirlpool. I didn't see this coming. How ruthless! The whirlpool claimed. Yeah, the, the, why do I have trouble talking? The whirlpool claimed my li husband's life. Anyways, yeah, you gave it what it deserved. I must express my gratitude somehow. I will see you at the boat. I will be waiting for you from up here. Okay, and yeah, now now that we have Klaus, this should give us a very good dish for tomorrow. Phew, that thing was extra ferocious. Okay. Now let me find a, a, a trophy to write home about. Are you going to pull out it, its teeth? Take, gimme, gimme. The meat is very tough. We're gonna make shark fin soup out of him. It's, it is fatty, though. Bonsa will like it. Uh, Klaus is thin. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah. But might as well tear this thing apart for an extra part. <laughs> but yeah, shark fin soup, from what I remember, is rather controversial. In that, typically, what people actually do for that is that they 
uh, I doubt I'd, I shouldn't, I probably shouldn't call them fishers, more like shark poachers. Uh, we'll just catch live uh, sharks and cut off the fin whilst they are alive and then just chuck the thing back into the sea to die since it needs that damn fin. Yeah. But if you caught a shark and cooked all of it, that would be fun of you, but yeah, I seen the videos where they just cut off the fin and dumped the live shark in like this is your outright cruel. Yeah. Like we've we've talked a few times already about how sharks have a bad reputation. Uh not wholly deserved. But yeah, just Yeah. Uh, hello. Smile for the camera or smile for the harpoon gun. Okay. Yeah. There are some dangerous sharks out there, sure, but not all of them are dangerous. Yeah, there are a bunch of passive uh, sharks as well out there. And what oh, yeah. are you besides persistent? And most times I, when a great white attacks someone, it's usually by a mistake. Yeah, a lot of shark attacks are because they confuse people for seals due to the outfits and such. Yeah, at least when it comes to great white and such, but the okay, only shark I think that sort of more usually attacks people intentionally might be bull and tiger, but I might be wrong. I think mm. I heard that bull and tiger are most commonly the ones that actually become man-eaters. Again. If the books I read as a kid were true. Zoom. So that is probably uh, it may has been probably actually yeah the, if I read that as a kid that's probably pretty outdated now. Could be. Okay, we should have plenty of copper ore. If not, it's easy enough to find. Iron ore is more annoying since we need to find. Hmm. Since we need to find the uh, limestone cave for that, yeah, I, I honestly think I honestly didn't think we'd beat him, especially with the triple. Yeah, okay. Guess I just got a lucky shot in with that. I, I was expecting you to do it, me, but just I didn't expect you to go. You needed to to fight it once. Yeah. I expected more close calls. Let's see. I was finally able to complete my long, uh, my long wait of revenge, thanks to you. As long as it gave you your, uh, as long as it gave you peace. This is for you. It is a necklace made of, uh, made of its teeth. I broke off just, uh, I broke off of it during my first encounter. Okay. Ooh, a shark tooth necklace. I can send some power into it. I believe sharks can regrow their teeth pretty quickly, like oh, in a yeah. few weeks. I don't need it anymore. But it will help you in your adventure. May you live in peace. Okay, is this going to be another damage up thing? Hmm. <clears throat> Shark to yeah, Netflix. Hello, sir. I could do that. Hmm? I, re I received a notification and. A super rare great white shark boss card? Oh, you must be a hardcore ma marine co play collector. I bet you would risk your life to get rare marine gun. Yeah, you'd risk our life to get them. Uh, I didn't do this to collect cards. I'm see am I seeing a Marinka completer in the making? Yeah, I guess it's time for me to make uh, way for the future generation. Which is a bit more ironic now since... Uh, Ash actually s stopped being the uh, main character of the Pokemon uh, series recently, I believe. I still find me the neighbor aged him up. Uh, yeah, we'll have to see if the if the franchise or at least the animated franchise survives without him and Team Rocket, since they're also getting retired. Uh, personally, uh, I'll need to see it to believe it, because let's be honest, Ash and Team Rocket are basically the the pillars upon the whole, which the whole series has been built upon. Okay. I cannot say if I agree or not for I... Again, I liked it when I was younger, but over the years I grew to like Digimon more and more. 
Gotta keep an eye on you. Godspeed. Yippee. <laughs> okay, he, he, made the, he made the noise of his cat his catchphrase, but the text is different. Let's see. Okay. Yep. Udo. Oh, you brought a picture. Yeah. Huh? What kind of fish is this? Did you paint the lips on to get more money? <laughs> Just kidding. Actually, I've heard of this kind of fish. Unimpressed Dave. Or unamused Dave. I'll put your picture to good use. I'm sure the readers will love it. Okay, 550. Oh, that would make diving around for on the water a lot more worth it for these photos. Yeah. <laughs> hmm. Oh, okay, really? let's do a little check and also set these back to what they were. There. Yeah, where's the top necklace? Uh, there it is. A necklace made with the teeth of Klaus the White Shark. It increases the damage of uh, harpoon guns by 15%. Okay. Wait, do we have, have one? Who that does that? Now we have a... Uh, <clears throat> We have gun damage with the octopus uh, thing. Oh, the yeah, octopus thing, but. Alright, guys, I can get about 30% more damage. Yeah, I don't think they'd let those stack that much. There's still Mima's. Uh, there's, there's still Mima's dumplings that adds torpedo. Yeah, not torpedo. <laughs> harpoon damage. Okay. I don't think I trust uh, you or David Torpedoes. Ah, oh, hello, another contestant. Alex the Fish Fryer. Okay. Hello, everyone. It's Yui uh, from NDC Station. Good to see you again. I'm Victor Yamoka. Here he is, appearing out of nowhere again. The previous episode of Challenge the Chef was as hot as molten lava. It was a, it was truly an interesting development. <laughs> and in today's episode, a new challenger appears. Let me introduce to you Alex Cooper, Cookstra's platinum-ranked chef from the United Kingdom. Yeah, he is he is totally a reference to Ken, I believe, from Street Fighter. Simply. <laughs> Uh, you must be the, uh, the sushi chef who beat Wang Pang uh, or Wang Pang in the last competition. Yes, I expected a fancier restaurant than this. Your establishment is humble indeed. Oh, the challenger is provoking the champion. This will be an exciting match. Today's theme is fried to sea. Both Japan and the United Kingdom are popular for their fried dishes. Their dishes may look similar, but are authentic each uh, in their own way. What? Funnily enough, I never actually went for fish and chips. Mostly because I prefer the, fi the type of fish that is typically fried for that uh, in a different way. Uh, we call it kibbling, which is basically just smaller chunks of it, uh, but uh, deep fried more, I believe. Uh, and yeah, typically uh, served with, uh, let's see, what was it? E yeah, a whiskey cocktail sauce. Mm. Okay. Yep. <laughs> During the weekly market every Wednesday here, there's a fish cart that, not a fish cart, but a local fish uh, seller nearby sets up a stall where they sell stuff like that. And well, other things, of course. And typically we go get it every week. Because mm. I never tried fish and chips. Actually, I have not eaten fish in years, except for that time I ate one sushi. That was it. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, I'm not, I'm not sure if you be, you'd be able to find anywhere near you that would sell kibbling. Or let me do a let me look up a quick translation. Uh, if my phone wants Are to you play along. Kibbling does not translate to kibble. No. It sounds similar, maybe. Yeah, and also, reason I saw the love earlier, you, you misspoke someone's name there. Uh, how? You said Victor uh, instead of Vincent. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, Google Translate just translates it to fried fish. Uh, so let me see if I can narrow this down a bit. 
Okay, the fish type is cod, and it's typically uh, cut into s smaller chunks. From I believe originally scraps were more used, but uh, over here a lot more stores that sell kibbling will s will actually cut the parts of the fish for it specifically, not just use remains or the rest bits. <clears throat> but yeah, deep fried okay. uh, cod pieces or cod nuggets, you could perhaps even call all them. I guess <clears throat> I could try those. That's Maybe. <laughs> up to you. Let's see. Whose dish will please the palate of Vincent and Judge? Can you guess the winner? Oh. My mouth is watering already. <laughs> what? Like before, we give you two days. I repeat, you have two days to compete. Oh. Dear audience, this match will be fire. Stay tuned and see what transpires in today's Challenge the Chef. I like her. She's so yeah. full of energy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he is definitely a Street Fighter reference. Especially with that move. Phew, it's an easy one this time. Your fried sea bream or uh, black tiger shrimp will, uh, will win the day easily. My choice is deep sea fish. But why? Because he's he he's always trying out new things. <laughs> if he's just if he's going for the old stuff, then he's need, not being Boncho. They are well known recipes, and I don't want to just replicate the tastes. I took up the kitchen knife to explore new ingredients and tastes of the sea. See, the flesh of deep sea fish is usually soft and gel uh, gelatinous. I will fry it and harden it to add flavor and texture. But you're not familiar with deep sea uh, deep fish recipes. What if Vincent doesn't like your dish? Mm. Don't worry, I will cook the best you know, deep fish uh, deep sea fish uh, deep sea dish. Mm. Mm. Today's main ingredients are mm. cookie cutter sharks. Already got that. Vampire squids, also, and binocular fish. That's a new one. Mm. The lineup is quite ambitious. <laughs> well, I will. I trust your hunch, Bancho. I will try to secure them. Okay. A frick ton of uh, fish coming in from this farm. Okay. Oh, oh wait. Barrel eye? It's barrel eye! The okay. I think what we read was a typo. Or a translation error. Uh, let's see. Oh. Ooh. Okay, we can answer you. Simple, in the well, in theory, but still plenty hard to actually perfect. Okay. Oof, I think mm. perfect people. Yeah. He really needs sleep. Oh, okay. So, okay, it looks like level ten is the max that you can upgrade the normal uh, sushi. It seems. Uh, let's double check that here. Level 10. And yeah, max level. Okay. So now we know that. Okay. Uh, now let's look at price. Tropical f uh, fish sushi set. Yeah, set. Let's see. Hmm. Let's put one of that on. And let's see, vegetable sushi. Mm, since it's pricey, I'll put it on. Then we have sweet and sour stargazer. Okay, egg, wheat, olive oil. Mm. Let's put, uh, we can only afford one of those, so no then. Low on rice. Let's see, big eye scad. Can be enhanced. Okay. Yep. Oh, I didn't have enough of those. Okay. Uh, hmm. Let's see. Is there a way to. Oh, okay, there is a way to sort by level. So let's just try to max out as many things as we can at the moment. Hmm. 
the tag was it probably be easiest to level up to max. There that's enough. Okay. You okay, you're still cheap as all hell, but oh well. There. Um, oh, okay, got a ton of shrimp. Yeah, we can't always rely on big dishes to bring us to you know bring in the money. So let's. Hmm. We will need to upgrade some of these smaller things to fill in the blanks. Let's see. Oh, you... Okay, you're from the Hammerhead. We are saving you for tomorrow. But we can upgrade you quite a bit. Yeah, for me, we're definitely going to try and get more Hammerhead in the next day. But having them pre-upgraded is probably a good idea. Uh, let's see. Uh, last time we got around 30 customers, so we need 27 more things on the shelves. So, let's see. That's uh, sea urchins. Okay. Nautilus. Uh, upgrade you. Okay. Let's put nine of these on. Then we have oh, got extras. Uh, let's see, seven, eighteen. We need twelve more. So there, that's one extra. Okay, and then we'll just fill out with this. Okay, that looks pretty decent. Probably not going to make. Probably not going to make an absolute uh, massive amount of profit, but we should still be good. And just in absolute backup, some of these. Like we get a ton of those, and we can't upgrade it any further, so might as well. Okay, research. White shark omelette. Okay, a unique omelette dish topped with white shark meat. The cushiony egg and tough shark meat com complement each other. Okay, let's research that for tomorrow. Okay, what's that? You were taking his fin. Yep. I just wrote it was not was fin soup. <laughs> okay, let's see. <clears throat> Pardon? <laughs> We don't have enough to. We don't have enough to upgrade someone to have their next skill unlocked. And let's see. You are a very good cook. Are a very good cook. You are very good at procuring and cooking. And you are a great cook. Okay. Uh, the thing I'd want from someone at the moment. Um, let's see. Can we? No details. Okay, serves cocktails. Hmm. We'll have to see if El Nino also serves cocktails whenever those come around. And um, yeah, we'll have to see how that goes then. This we'll find a replacement for uh, Raptor. For now, let's dispatch some people. What are we low on? Miso, okay. You three go for that. And then we have sesame seeds. You two go for that. And black vinegar. You can go on your own for that. Probably not the best distribution, but I will. No. Ingredients. Yep. 
The fin meat of Klaus. It can be used to cook a special dish. Onions. The onion is the vegetable that is the most widely cultivated species of the genus Elium. Under the whatever that is family. Some classify the genus under that, however. Okay, we have a lot of dishes that use it, but we don't know too many, if any of them. Yeah, no, we don't know any of them. Okay. That's taunting. Okay. It's... Oh, right. Duff. How's it going, Dave? It's been a while. What can I do for you? Um, I'm going to explore the glacial area, and I'm not sure if the weapon I have will be enough. Ah, oh, the huge glacier in the deep sea. I've heard about your mission. I planted a tracker in the gun. You could have told me that earlier. But the one I can craft right now with the ingredients I have will not be that different. Unless I can get my hands on some new minerals. Dave, I know you frequent the Sea People Village. Why don't you look for new materials there? Speaking of the village, I wonder how the Sea People Workshop is going. I should pay you a visit. Okay, so yeah, this is basically just steering you to the little quest line you get from uh, <clears throat> the, the, the Sea People Smith. Yeah, something the woman says that he might know how to make good uh, tools for the new area. One of the biggest and fiercest species among the great white sharks, the apex predators of the marine ecosystem. Clara Cruz uh, is looking for the, uh, is looking for this one to take revenge for her, uh, her husband who got eaten by its 36, uh, 36 years ago. <coughs> okay. uh, that looks to be it for the bosses here. So I'm, I'm, I'm cu I, I am curious if there are repeats, perhaps. Like rematches. Yeah, uh, here we got to fight the Megalodon, but. Okay. Is that a yellow fish? Oh! Okay, don't forget. I finally discovered the name of the thing. Can I keep calling a trilobite? It's not a trilobite. And now. It... I should have written it down. Uh, I think it was Anomia Psychus. It, it translated to abnormal shrimp. Okay. It's not a shrimp, though. And also, when it was alive, it was the apex predator of its time. The first apex predator, even, currently known. Okay. Uh, let's see, let's check. I think maybe he's a young version of that, and I think I saw a picture of a Helicoprion. Okay. Uh, this is a shop that looks like it's a circular saw a lower yaw. Okay. Yeah. Nino takes care of anyone who wants a drink, whilst Raptor takes the first charge on servings. And we just cover and take care of the uh, <clears throat> wasabi. It's I I can also take a look at the reviews now. So full of sushi energy. It was good. Thank you for the foods. Good, good, yum. Uh, what a nice clean meal that hit the spot. A restaurant's popular. Or this place is pretty hot these days. It's good. All right. Okay. Not the biggest amount of profit, but we still made it through. Okay. How many people was that? 22. Okay, so we wasted a bit, but oh well. We're still afloat. Uh, it's idiot. Alright. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, uh, there's a day though. But we hopefully make big. Yeah. Okay. Oop. Hello, Bacon. Phew, it's not, easy, it's not easy crafting a suit in one day. But I am me, so I did it. Ooh, that looks nice. 
<laughs> Why don't you go and uh, go on, go ahead and try it on? <laughs> I hope to took his measurement before. Oh, yeah. Ooh, that suits you well. <laughs> the size is perfect as well. Thank you, Dr. Bacon. It feels warm. Maybe because it was made of the divine tree fruit cloth? With that suit, you can free no, you can not only free and roam on the water, but also cold places freely. Good. Time to go down to the glacial area. Okay. Yeah. Can we probably do that in another uh, episode? <laughs> Unless we want some Greenland shark? You got a cold resistant suit that protects you from the cold environment of the glacial area. Upgraded further using Eye Diver to dive e even, even deeper. Okay. And yep, yeah, party day. And we've got a farming report. And this thing wants attention again. Okay, clean up. Cure you. Okay. And... Okay. Two food and two snacks should keep you happy. Okay. There. <clears throat> I'm going to guess that uh, whatever you end fish you end up with depends on uh, the amount of training and happiness and such you get with these. So why is it again showing as a new thing? Yeah, there's a. There's one thing I see that needs to do that weird surprise face. Uh, let's see, warning. Not sure what that's about. Let's see, let's give him some discipline to get that training up some. Which is slow going from the looks of it. Okay. Uh, let's see, anything new to put in? Oh. Investigate glacial marine plants one. Okay. Glacial clams. The video in face of starfish. Okay. Sea people artifacts. Okay. Jade marble and jade plates. Dangerous gemstones. And let's see. Regional ecology two. Narwhals. Okay. Wait, what? Yep. Wait, we can. You can hunt novels. Yep. Okay. And yeah, now that we have a new suit, we have a new depth limit to which we can dive. Yeah, okay. Now there's a question. Do we want the Greenland shark on the menu? Or should we focus on the sharks we have? <laughs> no. Okay, here you go, little thing. Okay. We could set the menu already. Uh, yeah, I don't. I don't expect we'll get more than thirty-ish customers, but we should still plan uh, well ahead. Oops. Yeah, it's been a while since we've seen this one. Actually, no, not that long, I believe. Without the context of the knife, that would probably come across as quite Cthulian. Cthulian? Is that even a word? Um, I am unsure. But yeah, we want these pretty pricey. Uh, let's see, no interest in that. Okay. Just gotta make sure we also have a good supply of it all. Okay, so we have 20 of that, 17 of that. We can't upgrade these any further. Uh, we could upgrade this one, but we'd only be left with two. Uh, let's see. Mm, not leaving with only two. This one we can upgrade. The short fin Mako. Okay, oh, you, you make big jumps. 
Hmm. Yep, there's also this one. Which we kind of overlook a bit since it doesn't look that much like a shark. Do we know if that is a shark? Yeah, it has the it has the ribbon next to it. Oh. Let's see. Oh, <laughs> there's also this one, so let's up. Uh, that's not going to be much compared to the rest. Uh, let's see. Zebra shark. Again, making big jumps once they start upgrading. Hmm. Yeah, we need more sharks, though. Again. Saving those. Could we go to the glacier depot like a Greenland shark? Or should we focus on the sharks we already have? Now, I say we give the glacial area a visit. And... Yeah, if we can't fight the fish there, we can at least give... Uh, <clears throat> we can at least return and give the others a whopping. Oh, hello. Tiger shark sushi. Oh, yeah, he didn't have enough fish that he needed for the contest with the cookie shark and all. Yeah, we have enough of that. So I'm not going to waste uh, that on... Uh, let's see. Oh, hello. Oh, yeah, that. Yeah, this one doesn't jump as much, but still getting it upgraded is nice. Yeah, and we can sell plen plenty of it. Yeah. Mm. yeah part of me wants to put just all of the shark meat that we have on, but it wouldn't fit. So, yeah. Okay, going to leave the rest open. Head uh, to the farm. Can you give him his uh, things for the... Yeah, we just need to way? have it. We just need to have it oh, in our right. inventory, I believe. Okay. Some eggs. Okay, these are growing decently. I'm going to save up the money at the moment. And, well, since we're here, we might as well refill this. Okay, fish farm. All right. Hmm. Yeah, we, we really should be getting... Do you have something to talk about? Oh, some new stuff. Oh, okay. Glacial area. We can now open, so let's do that. Okay. Now then, let's see how this is. Oops. Okay, a, lo <laughs> a lot of fish. Holy. And uh, even more shark. Let's see. Uh, okay. Th this, th yeah. that little bit on at the bottom, keep up to two, was added in during a recent patch, but I'm going to try and keep up to four of each so that it does. There's a lot more chance of uh, more fish each time day. So it, it would be nice if they give uh, if they gave a more if you if they let you set the variable variable on that yourself. Okay. At one point, it'll probably be a more profitable to actually sell these fish instead of uh, sending them out as ingredients. Yeah, being able to see how much of something we'd alre we already have in the kitchen of these would also be really appreciated. That way you would know well, if, you, if you'd be better off selling them or not. Let's see. Bunch of shrimp. Oops. Puffers. There. Okay, we still need a double of that and the tuna. Actually, it, it would probably be a good idea to hunt some tuna. <clears throat> to get them as breeding pairs since tuna are pretty valuable. Let's see. Okay, that's that for that. 
this one. Bunch of these. Okay. Then... I haven't had, had too much bleeding from the... Uh, all the sharks there yet, it seems. Yeah, we don't have many breeding pairs. I think we have only of the uh, of the tiger shark there. Yeah, I think there's only two uh, there. Extra there. No. There and there. Okay, that's all of that. Yeah, we could probably make quite a bit of money just from selling fish as well. Okay. There. Yeah, can you just do that for if you're short of money on, or something? Like, you really, really need an upgrade. Bunch of fish there that still need breeding pairs. Okay. Oh, what? Do we even have time for glacier area? Got that. That's... Uh, uh, we can take a peek. Da. Welcome back, uh, Tatum! Yep, yep, welcome back. <laughs> So we're about to head into a, a cold region. Yeah, okay. wait, I'm gonna ask this. What we remember? Tatum? Would you, would you feel honored if we named a chicken after you? Let's see. Then so, okay. <laughs> that's nice to hear. Ooh, that's very nice to hear. <laughs> but uh, yeah, Tatum, we can, we can get chickens here. And we can name them. So would you like to have a chicken named after you or name a chicken after someone else? We already have Liz, Hex, and Rom. Uh, Hex you won't know. The other two, I'm pretty sure you do. So would you like to name a chicken or be named after one? <coughs> Uh, okay. uh, don't worry if they may hit you with a soda. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think they like it too much. Okay, they want a chicken named after them. Yeah, uh, let me get close enough to chat. Up there. Okay. Uh, let's see. 40% chance of an egg grade chick egg. Uh, we don't have any brown chickens, uh, <laughs> raspberries. Uh, any of these three you would prefer, or would it, would it not matter which of these, uh, <clears throat> Tatum? Raspberry? Oh, I guess we have similar taste here. I drink, usually drink something raspberry of late here uh, during streams, or well, evening streams. Okay, these white chickens will all... Uh, okay, brown then. Yeah, white chickens will always lay an egg, though they have a very low chance of laying a, a great egg. Uh, brown chickens have a, just a chance of laying an egg, and but and free-range chickens have the same, but they have a higher chance. But yeah, brown chicken, there we go. And there. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> One extra chicken. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we don't have too much time left, but we can still take a peek at uh, the area. Uh, did we feed the cat? I think I did. Uh, even if not, we can show uh, Tatum the kitty. Or rather, kitties. Wait, 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 wait. Be warned. Cuteness ahead. Especially when it wants our piece. <laughs> uh, yeah, we can only feed it once a day. We don't want it to grow too... You know, but we don't want it to grow fat. <laughs> okay. 
Jag från Tatum. I think I failed that. I think you did. Okay. Schedule. Uh, okay. I think I'm better at making comical cat sound than actual cat sound. Like, move, move. Like that's one cat with a really freaking deep voice. Yeah. Okay. Do one. Oh, Into the glacial. Something made me think of Markiplier. May have the, it's his own lip. Some random animals. Okay. Um, let's see if we can catch anything down there, and if need be, we well, we have a we have a, a decoy. Let me make sure. Why did I only now realize Cobra's shirt is covered with bananas? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. I, I like how it also changed the color of his model or sprite more. Well, uh, yeah. Let's head down to the sea people and have a chat at the workshop. <clears throat> oh, yeah. They did say you need some better weapons for that area. Yeah. Do I craft materials that allow you to build more? Okay. Wait, does that mean that he can make some of the stuff that we need? Or that he, that he makes specific uh, materials for specific weapons or something? Also, nothing new here. Okay. Uh, might as well do it. <laughs> might as well cut things a bit short. <laughs> yeah, we can cruise around on a beluga whale. <laughs> okay. There. We'll have to dismount, and it does cost a little bit, but oh well. <clears throat> I'm still not feeling well. But good enough to reopen the workshop. Oh, you're open. What do you sell? Well, I have a wide variety of minerals available. I will give you a good deal on them. If you know someone you know, who knows what to do with minerals, it, it'd be a good idea to bring them to them. Oh, and. If you find something in the sea, bring it to me. I will buy it at a good price. Mm. Okay. Sure, we'll stop by your place before going up. Okay. Does that mean that he'll buy stuff like the golden fish statues and silver bowls for more than the cobra would pay? But actually, he, he would pay in a different currency. <clears throat> anyway, it's good to know that you're getting better. I will keep in touch, do I? Achievement, feeble blacksmiths. Oh, rude. Let's see. You can purchase ingredients from Dua's workshop to enhance weapons. Dua exchanges certain ingredients for Bay. All right. I uh, need to get okay, closer. Let's, this. let's see. Steel rope. That, that's called a chain. A wire made of iron alloy. It can be used to enhance guns. Ice diamonds. Okay, coral orb, opal tube, lava disc, divine tree fruit fragment, and just normal fragments. Okay, and we can sell to him. Yeah, for bay. <coughs> uh, let's see. Seems like he will pay the same in gold coins. About. Okay, so it's just which you need more with that. Okay. Hmm. I'm guessing when we go up, Duff will unlock a new, uh, a new line of upgrades uh, for the weapons. Mm. Yeah, we'll definitely need to hunt some tra giant trevales down for their fin to get, unless it's a new line of weapons, maybe. Mm. Either way, let's go hey. check out the last, er not the last, and the latest area. It'll probably be a bit of a pain to fish anything that's in here, but oh well. Actually... Uh, Antarctic octopus. Okay. Oh, I think we may... It has blue blood. 
I forgot we Royalty. can use the mirror to go straight to the glacial area. It'll also right. save us quite the swim to get there in the first place. <clears throat> Screw it. There we go. This is just going to be lazy. And the mirror is this way. Okay, just right next to it. Okay. Yep, this mounts. And off they go. Okay, glacial area. Now then, a polar eel pout. Okay. Short and hard barbs along its dorsal fin. Oop. A chew. Enter the glacial passage for the first time. Okay. Let me start off with a level 4 poison tip. Okay. Near you. Yep. All right. Going to be a bunch of new fish, a bunch of new recipes. Yep, we're on the way. See, yep, <laughs> exactly the thing we just learned of. Okay. Ice? Just ice fish? Okay. I knew there was such a thing as ice fish challenging, but I didn't think it'd be that literal. Okay. There's something else here besides these L-pouts, whatever they are. Yeah. What? Oh. Miss. There. Gelatinous snailfish. Okay. Wow, it's really warm. It's completely different from before. Well, time to really explore the area. Okay. with that. I, I like that there's frost buildup on the sides of the screen now. And I'm guessing that's going to increase as we get closer to our current diving limits. Arctic Cogs. Okay. Anything new in here? A fire Rifle Level 2. And let's actually bring that along. I should have switched out the, the sniper rifle before. Here we go, Wait, I realized. If you can hunt Greenland shark in this game, are they known to be slow? I don't know about those. A baseball? Okay. Oh, they, they can get very old, Hillian. Like, I think the oldest was around. 400, 500 years old? What is... Oh, Jade Marble. Okay. Okay. I, I like that we now just have a melee weapon that we can just throw. Okay. Um, okay, level four. Shock tip. Uh, did we catch you before? I see a new material. Yeah. Yeah, that must be ice diamonds. There. I don't have a pickaxe with me. So we'll Does see if the knife can break it. Oh, wait. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Our melee... Oh, wait, it's a limited amount? Okay. Catch. Yeah. Oh, well. 
Okay, there's a surprise that that is a melee weapon. And yeah, mining level is too low for that. So I, I like the music here. Yeah, it's lovely music and it looks very interesting here. Does it look really dark? This is kind of a refreshing change. Yeah, typically when you have ice stuff, it just goes dark and cold with it. Okay. Oh, very bright. Oh, hello. A little volunteer that creeps past. Okay, any new ingredients? Nope. Okay. Ice spikes in the wall. This one meant to be random. I saw on the same day you went uh, went to London. Oh. Yeah, for some reason YouTube regularly me an ad, which I did not watch, but I saw it pop up, pop up uh, among my recommendation. They do that now. They you can ha watch an ad amongst your recommendation. It was about Amsterdam. Okay. Amsterdam and. The dirt and the filth. Yep. Frozen cod, frozen fish that can be used as a blunt weapon. Harpoon damage plus one. Has a 30% chance to freeze the target for seven seconds. Inflict 30 damage to the frozen target. Let's give it a shot. Right. Useful. Uh, I, yeah, when I saw the title of the video, I just thought, what the heck is this? Are they insulting Amsterdam or does Amsterdam have some issue with the water or what is going on? Oh, 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 hello, you are Ooh. aggressive. Ooh. Wanna rethink that? Apparently not. Oh, they added the blue blood! Attention to the detail! Uh. Okay, that's the stream timer. Might need another try on this. <clears throat> Okay, yeah, Antarctic Octopus, and... Okay. Uh, let's continue exploring a little bit more here, and... <clears throat> oh, hello. Then we'll call it off? What is that? Okay. Oh, the current here is too strong to enter. Okay. Okay, I guess I'll need to fix. <clears throat> We can quite easily get out if we swim up to the portal mirror. So we should be good for air, in the absolute least, unless we get ambushed by something. Answer. Did I Go. catch one of you? I think it looks somewhat different than some of the others. If I were to get it. Okay, no, it's just a, one of another gelatinous one. Okay, uh, let's look around a little bit longer. If we get into trouble, we have this one. And yeah, it means that next time we will be con we will exp we will be exploring a new area. Yeah, hopefully we'll find some Greenland shark to add to the shark menu. Or well, next time, it will also be the shock event. Yeah. I mean, uh, hopefully let's... we earn a lot of money. Hmm. Are we serving Klaus Omelette? I feel like we're almost insulting him by turning him into an omelette. Yeah. Okay. This leads further down. Anything useful in here? Nope. Uh, trank tip might be useful. Just catching a few of these alive. Yep, like that. And what have we here? Oh, it's another. It's another. Okay, it's another mirror. Okay, so okay, these are escape good. points. Okay. 
Then let's head out, see if there's anyone who is going to contact us about upgrades like Duff. And then we'll go look for someone to raid. Okay. Mm. As expected. Uh -huh. Oh, there's a new type of mineral. How do you know when we're talking over the phone? <laughs> because I installed a CCTV, you know, a CCTV on your boat. Anyways, I will work on a new weapon when the mineral arrives. Jackass. I will add the ingredients I need to the list. Secure them and let me know. I will eagerly await, I will eagerly wait for the never before seen minerals to arrive. <laughs> By eternity. <laughs> and yet somehow he still knows which ones he needs. Okay, oh, new gun list. Death rifle. Okay. You can now create weapons with the Sea People's materials. Visit the workshop at the Sea People Village to find out about new materials available. Okay. Bunch of new rows. Okay. And harvest is done. And this thing was it. Okay, but we'll save that for next time. For now, let me take a little look. We haven't crafted one of these. Uh, I think we didn't. It's okay. Just craft. But yep. Okay. Nice that it says owned next to it. Okay. Okay, there we go. Grenade launch, let's not equip it. Okay, and yeah, it's in the upgrades now. Let's see. Level 2, Hermit Craft Pincer Piece. Okay. Fragments, fragment. We just need a lot of frag. Gravity launcher, what? Lancer modified to utilize the suction power of a wolf eel. Sucks in nearby creatures and explodes. Okay. Flat. Okay, 100% chance of paralysis for 10 seconds, movement speed minus 50%. Okay. Okay. And a tranquilizer gas launcher. Okay. Uh, that could be useful against groups, but first let's take a look here. That death rifle, and then we have explosive rifle, hell poison rifle, thunderbolt rifle. Okay, uh, what? Yeah, we can't see what we need for that because we need these jelly giant trevally fins still. Okay. What mm. the heck? Sniper rifle, death sniper, explosive. Okay, it's just harder terms. A penta rifle or penta axle. Okay, a quattro. Okay, that is actually what modified hush darts. Okay, that could be nice. And net gun gets steel net gun. Okay, increasing the number of targets that can be captured as well as the rank. Okay. Hmm. Now, if I didn't risk right. activating events and such, I would do a bit of off screen grinding for stuff like this. But. <clears throat> yeah, I am not going to. Uh, let's see. We can deliver one of these. Okay. And with that, let's save over the previous one, which is here. Okay, then we save and quit. And we're going over here to look for someone to raid. So give me a second to move the screen share over from OBS to uh, Twitch. Oh. Hey, Thomas Friedenshoving. V W. <coughs> W T H screaming yeah. fate. Oh, I think the me scream. What the heck? Yeah, what the hell? What was that in response to Tatum? <laughs> okay, uh, let's see. We have Hisaya Rozier who is streaming Volcano Princess. Can't say I heard of that. But, uh, yeah, the, <laughs> all of Duff's cutscenes are like that, Tatum. <laughs> uh, let's see. Okay, is this some sort of... 
Okay, I can't really say what kind of a uh, game this is, judging by what little I'm seeing uh, from Hisaya here. Um, next, we have Sour Roll with, with Starfield. From, I've not heard too much about Starfield, but I have heard mixed messages in the little... Uh, in the... <clears throat> pardon. I have heard mixed messages in it, uh, of what I have heard. Next, we have... I'm nice who is streaming Final Fantasy 14. Okay. Uh, Big V Streams is streaming Baldur's Gate. Karen I is streaming Sea of Stars. Or is going to at least because they're in their pre stream. Chubbers the Moon Seal is streaming Dark Souls Remastered. Kiri Natsuyoko is streaming Clone Hero, which is basically, well, it's a Guitar Hero. Horatius, yeah, Horatius the Dwarf is streaming Fear and Hunger. Okay. Oh, this one might be of interest to you. WBPL is streaming Heroes of Mighty Magic 3. Oh! We, we are rating them. <laughs> I thought so. Okay. Copy that name. And then we head on over to our place. Slash raids. And paste. But before we start that, of course, thank you everyone who has been watching now or later. Thank you, Tatum. Thank you, Glacier Boy. And th 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 uh, yeah, those were the speaking persons. Also, I see you in the chat there, <laughs> Lurking Sensei. <clears throat> and yeah, thank you anyone else has, you know, who's been watching now or later as well, of course. And thank you as always, Rick here. You're welcome as always, my friend. And thank you all for joining. Uh, yeah, if I don't fall asleep in the next two-ish hours, we will try to do a second stream today uh, of Owlboy, the uh, <laughs> the replacer, or the game that was supposed to replace Dave the Diver as one of our side quests, since we're moving Dave to the main sp uh, spaces in the main week. But uh, I just wanted to play it again after, <laughs> all, after all the airport bullshit. Uh, I think I forgot to say that, but uh, yeah, I, I'm just, I, I just came back from a, vac a few days vacation to London, which had another evening added onto it, because our flight got cancelled out of bloody nowhere, uh, after being first delayed by two hours, then the delay jumped down to one hour, and then just poof, and they didn't even have the freaking decency to you know, <clears throat> try and reschedule us or try and get us uh, a hotel room or anything because the next flight that would be going would be the next day so uh yeah i've i think i've hit about uh, 30 hours awake at this point so yeah, yeah i might just collapse yeah <clears throat> hopefully we'll be able to stream and he'll be able to sleep peacefully after but if he does fall asleep before stream, I am. Um, I may pull to see if he's awake. Yeah. I'm probably not gonna f try to wake him up. I will not do that. Ooh. <clears throat> like, I feel tired, but at the same time, not. It's this stupid paradox. Yeah. Oh, yeah. that sounds like me. Anyways, let's get that raid started. No blocks. Okay. So, uh, yeah. Thank you all again for watching, and until next time, have a nice day, and until then. Be safe, everyone, and watch out for zombie seagulls. <clears throat> oh, and do tell me if the outro is too long or something, or too loud. It's not.